Welcome to part two of my visiting every town and weir station. In this part we will be visiting From Sunderland to Pelor Metro Junction, the Metro shares tracks with National Rail Services. The five stations in this video are all in this section. We start here at Sunderland, with its island platform, which serves both National Rail and the Metro. Rationalised over the years, the original station was rafted over in the 1960s to allow office developments above. Refurbished in 2006 with money from the Metro network. After crossing the River Weir on the Munkham Weirmouth Bridge, we come to St Peter's, another station which serves the local university. Opened in March 2000. The station also served as a temporary terminus for Northern Spirit services during the rebuilding of Sunderland Station. On the platforms can be seen the former Monks Weirmouth station which closed in 1967. This is now a small museum. Is 
Stadium Alight station of course serves the Sunderland FC football ground. Opened with the Metro in March 2002, has two platforms and is coloured in the Sunderland colours of red and white. Seaburn Station was opened by the London and North Eastern Railway in May 1937. Served by National Rail Services from Newcastle to Sunderland until conversion to Metro use in March 2002. That's two platforms and it's coloured blue and white. East Bolden is another station that was operated by National Rail until 2002, opened in 1839.
station is situated by a level crossing. Join me again in part 3 where we visit further metro stations. The next train at platform 2 is for airport.